Today, I'm going to be doing a five month update for my postpartum body and for that little chunk over there. She just turned five months the other day. So therefore, I just turned five months postpartum the other day. In her five month update, I'm going to tell you guys first. I'm going to talk to you guys while I'm cooking breakfast. For Dylan, I already ate breakfast, but so her postpartum, her update is that she's rolling over. She's so close to crawling. She really is. She's like lifting herself up in her butt up. But she just can't put all the movements together to go like this and crawl. She's walking when I hold her. She walks, which is really good. She's healthy. She's 14 pounds five months old. A lot of babies are bigger. She's on the lower side of the scale, but she's still like healthy. She's just trying a little, a little slower than everybody else, um, which is fine. Um, she is not sleeping in her crib. She sleeps with us because she will not sleep in her crib. So she sleeps with us. And she sleeps on our bed for naps. So that's how that's going. Which is fine. We're okay with it. And we enjoy having her sleep with us for the most part. But it is hard sometimes because you want to be able to have time with your partner or in the middle of the night to go to the bathroom. I have to do a lot of weaving around the bed to get out of the bed without waking her up to go to the bathroom and it wakes her up most of the time so that's really hard she isn't eating any food but these little mesh things that they put in the freezer with like banana or strawberry or whatever inside of it and she'll suck all of the juice of the fruit so she does like that and frozen she likes it when it's frozen, but other than that, she's not really interested in food yet, which is fine. So that's Peyton's update. She's doing pretty well. And then for my update, I have, I'll show you guys my body. I have stretch marks everywhere. I lost about 15 pounds. Fifth, well, since giving birth, I have lost 20 pounds. But, because I didn't gain a lot during my pregnancy, but about right now i'm 20 pounds down probably like 25 or 30. i still have a lot of the baby weight on my stomach and right here not too much i was about 150 when i first got pregnant i'm 170 right now so but I go to the gym in the mornings before she wakes up and before Dylan wakes up. Super early in the morning, that's when I go. Like 4.30 a.m. I go to the gym. I stay there in about 6 or 7 and then I come home. And then make breakfast, that's usually how it goes. I go to LA Fitness. But I'll show you guys my body. So this is my stomach. You can see all the jiggle and all the extra skin right there. And then right here. And then you can tell I have a lot more stretch marks. I had none of these stretch marks before I got pregnant. So I definitely gained a lot of stretch marks, pregnancy stretch marks. This is one of my biggest insecurities. And my arms are one of my biggest 
first ones. And my arms were already like not super skinny before pregnancy. And then this is what they look like now. Like this, I want to get rid of right here. They're not terrible, but like they're not to where I like them. So definitely want to work on those too, but I've been working on my legs, my arms, I've been doing everything, cardio and stuff like that, so trying to get back um, to looking better. But yeah, I, I was trying to lose weight before. I was losing weight and going to the gym every single day and like eating really good and stuff like that before pregnancy. So now that I have pregnancy, I have even more weight I'm trying to get off. So sucks, but it is what it is. Um, my body did a beautiful thing and created and carried a beautiful thing. So I'm trying to kind of accept that and then So, that's our update. Um, she's doing really good and I'm, I feel great after my gallbladder surgery. As you guys know, or if you've seen or been on my channel before, after I gave birth, I instantly had a gallbladder problem. And I was throwing up and losing weight and from that alone, I lost 25 pounds. Um, but yeah, so I was just, it was really bad and then I finally got surgery and that's what these scars are right here. There's a scar right there. And then right there, and then right there, and right there. Those are the scars from my gallbladder surgery, removal surgery. So there's that, but, and I healed from that too, so. It's been crazy, but doing a lot better but yeah. i hope you guys enjoyed our video and our update make sure you guys do subscribe to this video and keep thumbs up and i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys oh also let me know in the comments down below or on my instagram go on my instagram and let me know videos you guys want to see because it really helps me out so yeah